Good morning, everybody. It's Midnight and Beyond. Welcome to the finale of Undertale. It's you. So you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then. Now, you will be judged. You will be judged for your every action. You will be judged for every EXP you've earned. What's EXP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points. A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your EXP increases. When you have enough EXP, your love increases. Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for Level of Violence. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you will hurt the more easily you can bring yourself to hurt others. Now you understand. It's time to begin your judgment. Look inside yourself. Have you really done the right thing? And considering what you've done, what will you do now? Take a moment to think about this. Truthfully, it doesn't really matter what you said. All that's important is that you were honest with yourself. What happens now, we leave up to you. We have killed two people throughout this journey. One was a regular enemy by accident. The other was Toriel, also by accident. But when you think about it, after hearing that story, we're no better than the ones who killed Azriel. They killed out of fear. They took one look at Azriel, saw them with a human in their clutches, and made their own decision on what they were doing and on who Azriel was. Toriel tried everything in her power to stop us and I truly, truly thought there was no other option but to fight her. Even though I was told from the very beginning that I wouldn't have to fight anyone. It's my fault she's dead. I can't blame anyone else but myself, my own fears, my own insecurities, and my own stupidity. My inability to learn, or to listen. Toriel is dead. And it's all my fault.
What's down here? Oh my god. It's a coffin. There's a name engraved on it. Human. It's empty. I can't go any further. Our heart is red. I assume that would be the name of whatever we named our character, but... All those other coffins... I wish we could examine them. There's nothing else left to do. It's time to face all of the consequences for our actions. Dum dee dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. Here we are. Howdy. How can I? Oh. I so badly want to say, would you like a cup of tea? But, you know how it is. Nice day today, huh? Birds are singing. Flowers are blooming. Perfect weather for a game of catch. You know what we must do. When you are ready, come into the next room. I was right, wasn't I? That's Asgore. The king of the underground. The husband of Toriel. I'm so sorry. How tense. Just think of it like... A visit to the dentist. Are you ready? If you are not, I understand. I am not ready either. This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If... If by chance, you have any unfinished business, please do what you must.
I can only imagine the millions of other things we could do in this game. From what I have been led to believe, every single choice mattered on this adventure. There are a million different outcomes to everything we could have done. But this is my first time exploring this world. So... I couldn't possibly fathom... what it is I would actually want to do. The only thing on my mind right now... is seeing this battle through to the end. Maybe one day we'll come back. But for now... This is what I must do. I see. This is it, then. Ready? A strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination. Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Oh, God. This is the final battle in the game against Asgore. Something tells me I would still have the option to show mercy if I didn't kill Toriel. Oh, my stinking God. What were those heart containers for? What can I do? I can check and I can talk, that's it. I have a pitifully small amount of healing items. I don't know what else we could do. They made me really not want to kill Asgore. But they also make it seem like I lost that opportunity after all that I've done. Let's try talking. But there was nothing to say. Oh my god! Oh Jesus! Oh, this is gonna be a battle. This will be a battle. Yeah, I know there may be nothing to say, but I'm gonna still try! Okay. His attacks are crazy, I'll say that much. His attack is 80, defense is 80. That's all there is to him, he's just an incredibly powerful enemy. Uh, just keep dodging. Oh, Jesus, what? What even was that? Oh, God, I don't even know. I don't want to attack him at all. I'm just gonna keep on doing this. I feel like that might be what we need to do. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. But maybe we need to get his HP lowered a bit to get him back to his senses? I have no idea. Maybe attacking would be even worse. That's it. Okay, it's just like the- it's just like our stick. That's all we need to do. Oh, God! But also, where the fruit is singing flowy or flowy or whatever? Like, it made it seem like we were gonna fight him instead, but now is our Asgore and Flower the same person? Because he said howdy when we saw him? But... I don't know. Oh god, we're down to 7 HP. I might need to... a pie? Where'd we get a pie from? Oh, who's from... there? Okay. We got a Glam Burger, we got Glam Burgers. I have three healing items for this entire battle. This is gonna go horribly. Oh, I get it. Before it was only orange, so I was just like running around like crazy because I was freaking out, but no, it's blue and then- okay, I get it. I get it then, okay. That's easy enough to avoid. Uh, hit down- not down the middle, but still pretty good damage, all things considered. 
Okay. No, just keep on trying. I assume something will change at some point in time. Whether we just hold out long enough, don't do any damage, or if we just gotta do a little bit of damage until he says something. Something needs to change. I refuse to believe that there's no hope in any of this. Oh god! Uh, okay. Almost down the middle, 140. Did I do it? Oh my god, it's so stinking difficult to dodge that. Oh my god! 141. Why oh, couldn't it have been like that with Toriel? God darn it. Oh god. Uh, we're gonna have to use another item. I am not prepared for this fight at all. Eat the Glam Burger, cover 27 HP. Okay. Oh jeez! Huh. Huh. Just keep on attacking. It's nothing but a waiting game. I, w I really wish I knew what to say right now. I'm just so on edge. Like, is there any way I could even possibly do this without all the healing items that I need? I really don't want to just think of backtrack. Like, I know it's part of the blind experience, but I don't know. I don't like dying in the final battle. It just ruins all the stinking tension and everything. Maybe this is one of those points where dying will actually do something. I don't think I know, but I'd rather not find out. Go ahead and do that. Oh, Jesus. Let's go ahead and eat the pie. It was given to us for a reason, right? We got the pie. That's it? There's literally nothing else? Didn't we have the butterscotch pie? What happened to that? Eat the butterscotch That was it? Our HP was maxed out. The smell reminded Asgore of something. Asgore's attack went down. Asgore's defense went down. If we save the pie up until this very moment, then we'd be able to use it as a weakness. Well, I'm glad I saved it. But is it going to help us all that much? 174, that's pretty good. But still, do we have anything else to remind him of? Toriel? What else did she give us? Well, we don't have it. If she did give us anything else, I probably sold it because I'm stupid. Can I talk to him? There's nothing to say. Oh, I'm gonna regret this. Go in there? Okay. Just attack. I'm out of healing items, so it's just a matter of... Oh, I'm so stinking confused. Oh my god. There's 263. We might get to the end of this, we might get to the end of this, we might get to the end, 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 okay. Right down the middle, 295. I have 3 HP, this isn't happening. I can't do it. Apron, burnt pan. I have 1 HP. Asgore has low HP, but so do I. What the fruit do I do? Oh. So that is how it is. I remember the day after my son died. The entire underground was devoid of hope. The future had once again been taken from us by the humans. In a fit of anger, I declared war. I said that I would destroy any human that came here. I would use their souls to become godlike and free us from this terrible prison. Then, I would destroy humanity and let monsters rule the surface in peace. 
Soon, the people's hopes returned. My wife, however, became disgusted with my actions. She left this place never to be seen again. Truthfully, I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. I just wanted everyone to have hope. But I cannot take this any longer. I just want to see my wife. I just want to see my child. Please, Yan Wan. This war has gone on long enough. You have the power. Take my soul and leave this cursed place. Oh my god. This is it, huh? I don't know what's worse at this point. Do I kill him and escape from this place? Do I show mercy and attempt to leave with Toriel's soul? Or is that not even an option? If I show mercy, do I stay here forever? But if I show mercy, is that just going to be torturing him even more? Would showing mercy show him that there is good in humanity? That I'm not... I'm not like the one who took away his son. But at the same time, am I? I took away his wife. What will showing mercy do? I have a feeling that it's clear as day what happens if I fight. But I have no idea what will happen to me or to him or to anyone if I show mercy. What will that represent, at this point, after everything I've already done? I guess... What I'm going to decide... Is what I think she would want me to do. I hope that will at least allow me to create some way in which she could forgive me one day. After everything I have done to hurt you, you would rather stay down here and suffer than live happily on the surface? Human, I promise you, for as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you as best we can. Please don't tell me he doesn't know. We can sit in the living room telling stories. 
Eating butterscotch pie. We could be like... Like a family. You idiot. You haven't learned a thing in this world. It's kill or be killed. Did I mess up horribly? Howdy! It's me, Flowey! Flowey the Flower! I owe you a huge thanks. You really did a number on that old fool. Without you, I never would have gotten past him. But now, with your help, he's dead. And I got the human soul. Boy, I've been empty for so long. It feels great to have a soul inside me again. Mm, I can feel them wriggling. Oh, you're feeling left out, aren't you? Well, that's just perfect. After all, I only have six souls. I still need one more before I become God. And then, with my newfound powers, monsters, humans, everyone, I'll show them all the real meaning of this world. Forget about escaping to your own safe file. It's gone forever. But don't worry. Your old friend Flowey has worked out a replacement for you. I'll serve over your own death. So you can watch me tear you to bloody pieces. Over and over. And over! What? Do you really think you could stop me? You really are an idiot. Oh my god! How the fuck am I supposed to survive this thing?! Oh my god, my- is this even- is this even possible?! No, no, no!
Did you really think I was gonna be satisfied? Killing you only one time? Oh my stinking Christ. Is this even possible? Am I, like, I don't know what to take seriously or not. Did he actually delete the save file? Is this, am I actually doomed to be stuck here because I messed up? I shouldn't have shown mercy. I actually should have listened to him saying it was killed or be killed. That can't be it. Come on. Uh, what if I just hide back here? I swear to God, that's the solution. I'm going to laugh. File saved. Oh, no, I'm getting murdered again. That's not good. Also, what the fruit is that face? Oh, my God. This is stinking terrifying. Nightmare fuel of the highest caliber. I did one damage. Oh, my God. But, no, I can actually win this? Oh, my God. No, 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 no. I actually have to stink and win this. This is actually a thing. I did one damage. It's all just a- Yeah, I know it's a bad dream and I'm never waking up. There has to be something I can do. No, 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 no. I refuse to believe that this is the end of the game. I refuse. I have to be able to do something. There's no stinking way. I can do this. I s they give me a fight option. There is a chance. I refuse to believe. Pathetic. Now you're really going to die. Yeah, there's different text. There has to be something. I refuse. I refuse to lose to you. You stinking monster. Oh my stinking god. The fact that he's so stinking evil. He uses the howdy phrase like he probably wanted us to think that he was Asgore so that we would be okay with killing him because we thought it would be a trap if we didn't kill him. But no, he wanted us to show mercy. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Is there any way to dodge any of this? Oh my god, how far can we even go? No, no, no. One damage. There has to be no, 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 no. I have to be able to do some warning. Blue. Going here, maybe? You called for help. Somehow I'm not getting any damage to me this time. Okay, I'm okay with this. I'm not okay with this, I offer Jesus Christ! Oh my god, oh Jesus, how does this even exist? How did I go this long without ever seeing this? Kudos to the Undertale community for not spoiling this jank. But what the fruit? Now we did three damage. Okay, I see where this is going. We can win this fight. It is possible. I'm not gonna, oh my god, it's gonna take forever, but... Oh, we were close to another transition. We were so close. You realize what will happen if you defeat me? No, I don't! How about you let me do it and let me find out? So, at least we're speeding up through it now. Can I at least skip the phases? Oh, I can? Okay, so we're on this phase now of the missiles. Okay, so at least they're kind about it. Okay, five damage. So, okay, I'm, I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. We just have to keep on surviving. I don't even know what to say. What am I even looking at? Like, sorry, I'm, like, I try to be all composed and, like, dramatic during these final boss fights, but that's what you get when you go into a stinking blind up here and, like, what even is this? What can I even comprehend this being? I, it's, I don't even know. And yet, it's still somehow less terrifying looking than that stinking salesman at the Metaton Hotel. Uh, there's gonna be an act option somewhere around here. There it is! Get in there. You called for help? Gonna turn into a bunch of bandages? Yes, indeed, indeed! Oh, I actually have to fight for them this time. Okay. Okay, oh dip! Uh, file saved again. Jesus Christ, file too loaded. Oh, it's like save states and ROM hacks and I'm all back in the dizzy day that I didn't exist in because I'm a filthy child who wasn't born early enough because I'm lame like that. File too loaded? Jesus Christ. Okay, blue heart time. Blue heart time. He's got six hearts, so I assume there are six phases. There was no fight option that time. 
Uh, I'm gonna do nothing. Um, I can't go up here. Act. Called for help. I assume, okay, okay. I assume whoever souls these are, are the ones, oh, I shouldn't have done that. Why am I so stupid? Uh, I assume the one who souls these are, they're the ones fighting against Flowey, like, still trying to hang on to what little amount of control they have over their own soul. And they want us to get out of here alive. Uh, 15 damage this time. Oh, Jesus. Come on. Survive all of this? How do I survive with this stinking lawn? I have no idea, and I'm dead. Cool. This is a fight. This is a stinking battle. Like, it's definitely one of the coolest final bosses I've ever seen. Unless I have a opportunity to run out of chances. There's no such thing as happy endings. This is all that's left. I don't believe you. I do not stink and believe you. Yeah, just keep on laughing, Flowey. This thing's stinking terrifying. I can't believe I've, like, gone this long without ever seeing this thing. Or maybe I have, and, like, I just didn't know it was, um, an Undertale reference. Like, actually, at Camp Fangamer, there was a t-shirt that everyone made by, like, drawing, a uh, one it was like an outline of the Fangamer logo, and we all had a sticky note that we drew a picture on, and we filled out the outline of it, and we each got to contribute a miniature pixel to the final drawing, which was like this big Fangamer logo made of a bunch of little drawings that everyone made. Uh, I'll flash up the the shirt on screen so you can see. I'm pretty sure like it's only available if you went to Camp Fangamer. I'll show you which one mine was. I drew an Australophant from Mother 3, but... It'd be hilarious if the final stinking boss of Undertale was on this shirt this whole time and I had no idea. I'm sure Flowey's on here, but whatever the fruit this thing is, I know it's Flowey, but whatever the fruit this thing is called or whatever, I would not have predicted that it was the final boss of Undertale. And 15 damage again. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, avoid, 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 Okay, oh, the stinking, oh, everything's so horrible. Hurry up, okay, good, purple heart, purple heart, purple heart. Okay, this is phase four, I think? I don't think the phases matter, the homework. Doom, cruelty, trapped, horror, nightmare, terror. It's like the opposite of nice cream. No, my one true weakness. Oh, why, of course I got caught on death. Uh, act, you called for help. Uh, uh ruin, nightmare, cruelty, oh, mercy, luck. Uh, create, hope, kindness, calm. Oh, uh, not enough. Oh my god, you seem terrifying. Oh, Jesus Christ, get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I really hate this. Oh, Jesus, come on. No, no, file too low. What? He could bring me back there? Like, oh my god, that's a stinking jerkish move. This is phase five, I think. Again, there was no fight option during that part. Frying pans. Okay, I get it. Uh, but where's the act? Where's the act? Oh god, imagine if I miss it. That would be horrible. Uh, act, there it is. Aha! Piping piece of act. Called for help. I wonder who we're calling. We're calling the souls, obviously, but... Okay, give me them! Give me them eggs! Oh yeah, delicious, delicious, uh, hot, boil, hot pile, what's it called? Sunny side up eggs! That's what it is. Okay, oh Jesus! Get out of here, get out of here! Oh, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Oh god, that was so much damage, so much damage, so much damage. Oh god, 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 no, 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 no. Fight, fight, fight! Oh, we got 24! Oh my god, do I actually have to keep on doing this until I'm stinking finished? It's gonna take forever, but that's what... There's only one word to describe someone who would stay on this stinking battle for so stinking long, and that is determination! With a voice crack. Very important to have the voice crack. A gun! Oh god! Uh... He's gonna shoot me with determination eventually, or shoot me with an act. Come on. Wait, does that mean I have to actually wait for the bullet, or is it gonna come somewhere else? I swear to God. Okay, okay, go, go. Call for your call for help. Just stand still, and shoot me with the health packet. Thank you. Oh, of course I have to. Oh, it's a clover, so I have to like. It's luck based. God darn, I hate you. I stink and hate you. Flowey's defense dropped to zero! This is gonna be it! Oh my god! Fight! 211! It didn't do all that much. Uh, 174! 
186. Oh, this is it, Floyd. This is stinking it. You're going down, you stinking sicko, flower, mother, trucker, son of a gun. Gosh darn it, all the heck, I stink and hate you. I saw a 69 in there, couldn't be a final battle without a 69 from Midnight and Beyond Incorporated. Get the egg. Oh my god, this is stinking amazing, this is stinking amazing, this is stinking amazing, this is stinking amazing, this is stinking amazing. Oh, no, 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 I don't like this. I don't like how many of those are coming out. Oh, geez, here come the fire and the flames. Uh, get that, get that, get that. Oh, this is going to be real unfortunate if I lose here. Come on, it's all epic and everything. We got the power of all the hearts and everything. Come on. Fight. Clover. Fight. Oh, jeez, fight. Music note. Fight. Oh, jeez. Give me the Clover. I said I didn't like you before Clover, but I like you right now and you're easy to get a hold of. Get that, get that. Oh my god, how the heck am I staying alive for this? Oh my stinking god, it's gonna be real unfortunate if I ruin the dragon tension and end up dying. Oh no, I missed him! Oh no! jeez, this is gonna be bad, this is gonna be bad, this is gonna be bad, this is gonna be bad. Back at that. Oh, we're almost there, we're almost there, we're almost there. We stayed determined till the bitter end. No matter how difficult it was, no matter what mistakes we made, we stayed true to our adventure, no matter the cost. And this battle is over! No! This can't be happening! You! You! You idiot! could defeat me? I am the god of this world! And you? You're hopeless! Hopeless and alone! Golly, that's right. You're worthless, right? Oh, can't save you now! Call for help! I dare you! Cry into the darkness. Mommy! Daddy! Somebody help! See what good it does you! Boy, what a shame. Nobody else is gonna get to see you die! What? How'd you... Well, I'll just... W where are my powers? The souls? What are they doing? No! No! You can't do that! You are supposed to obey me! Stop! Stop it! In your world, it's kill or be killed. But not in my world. What are you doing? Do you really think I've learned anything from this?
let me live! I'll come back. I'll kill you. I'll kill everyone! I'll kill everyone you love! Because in my world, I believe in hope. And that is Undertale. Hey ya! Is anyone there? Well, just calling to say... You made a snowman really happy. Guess I should say something else, too. Since you left, things down here... are different. With Asgore gone, Undyne became the ruler of the underground. She's decided to destroy every human that comes here. And since the human souls disappeared, she's also looking for a new way to break the barrier. And when she does, she's going to wage war on humanity. I mean, that was Asgore's plan too. But he was really, uh, bad at it. Undyne has also expanded the Royal Guard massively. She says the first thing she'll do after we get out of here is take her army and personally hunt you down and destroy you. Meanwhile, I've been knocking on the door to the ruins, but that woman hasn't been answering me. Maybe she's not feeling well. Hey, Sans, who are you talking to? Oh, just the human. Oh, cool. Wait, did you say the human? Can I talk to them? Sure, knock yourself out. Hey, Undyne's the Empress now! It's amazing, and she appointed me to be the most important royal position! That's it. That's literally the title. What do I do? She told me to, um, stand around and look cute. Well, that's the perfect job for me. I do that all the time, without trying. Finally, I'm important, and it's all thanks to you! And the horrible things you did. Thank you, human. Come back and visit sometime. Wait, Undyne would probably kill you. But you'd get to see me. So you gotta risk it. You gotta! See you soon! Hey. Since you defeated...
defeated me. I've been thinking. Is killing things really necessary? I... I honestly don't know anymore. I have a request for you. Prove to me. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Get here from the beginning without killing a single thing. And I won't kill the king. Then you'll have your so-called happy ending. So, what will it be? Will you prove yourself? Or will I get to watch you suffer? Either way, I'm interested.